Well, hello YouTube. Tennessee Wingman here with you. We're about ready to uh, take off and take a ride and let's go check out that uh, new tire we put on yesterday. I was going to go out riding, but I did not make it yesterday. But we'll see about today. And let's see if we can't get this garage shut down. Be real careful with this new tire. It uh, it's going to uh, be kind of slick until it gets broken in. Don't want to disturb it too much. CB's coming in. Take the squelch up a little bit and turn the CB volume down some. Boy, these bikes sure do handle nice on new tires. Let's go keep going on. I think I'll go into town and stop at the auto parts store. I'd like to give me a set of swivels. Maybe a torque wrench. I calmed down from uh, my experience with uh, Statesboro Power Sports and their uh, outrageous prices <clears throat> for their services. But I'm not done with the campaign. I need to do some social media posting and make sure that everybody I can reach knows about uh, their their practices are it shouldn't be that way it shouldn't be uh, just because you got a motorcycle then they want to uh, think they can take advantage of you I don't like that I don't think it's right I wasn't that way when I was in business charge a man a fair price for a fair job and you earn his repeat business for many years well I asked the missus to go out for a ride with me and she looked at the temperature and it was 68 degrees and she said nah the wind's gonna be too cold I don't think I moved far enough south for her. But it is absolutely beautiful. 68 degrees, partly cloudy. I love it. I might ride all afternoon. They ride down to the beach just to get gas. <laughs>
What temperature did you do you stop riding or do you? I don't mind the temperature, it's the rain. I've ridden in a lot of rain and I don't like any of it. I don't mind the cold. If it gets into the 30s, it's really cold. But I've, uh, over the years, added some things that make that a little bit more real, uh, tolerable. My good gone to Gold Wing here has got heated grips and a heated seat. And this past year, I got the heated jacket and I uh, got the heated gloves. I didn't get the heated pants. I'm a short fellow and it's hard to find things that fit. So I got some leathers, you know, that I could use on my legs. My legs, legs never were a real big problem to start with. It was always my hands and my feet. Well, I'll kick it back on a little bit later when I get uh, get done with the store. <laughs>